Hello, welcome to my channel. Uh, in today's video, I have a My Life as Accessory set. Um, I was in Walmart the other day and saw it and I was like, oh my goodness, uh, that's really cute. And I really love the food accessory sets from My Life As. They're usually very unique. They've got lots of pieces to them. Usually, definitely not for really small children. I mean, look at those pieces. They're so small. Um, and this is a boba tea play set. And boba tea is very popular right now. Um, it's actually, uh, at my job, there's a group of people that every Tuesday and Thursday... Uh, they they have a huge delivery, like you order it in advance and they have this huge delivery uh, that comes and like everyone is drinking boba tea in the afternoon. I have not participated in it because it is kind of, you know, I, I really like to spend my money on doll stuff and not boba tea, but uh, they all really like it and I know it's very popular right now. I do believe Walmart is also selling a boba tea doll, and I think she comes with some extra stuff. Um, I don't, I try not to buy dolls, you know, just for their accessories or outfits, because then I feel bad that I have this doll with no clothes, and, you know, like, I'd love to donate her, but then she doesn't have clothes, and I just feel really bad about that, so I haven't, um, I haven't done that because there's a couple of our generation dolls too that I'd love to do the same thing for. But in terms of the dolls themselves, I'm very much American Girl only. But for accessory sets, I have no brand allegiance. Whoever's got the cute stuff, that's where I'm going. I did want to flip to the back real quick because I absolutely love this. Spread positivity. And I think that's so cute. I think I'd love to recreate it. I'm going to take a picture of it before I recycle this backboard. And see if I can recreate that or find a copy online and print it out. Um, not that I have a spot to sell tea and I, it's just, I don't know. I really thought this was cute. Um, so uh, there are lots of different items in here. So let's go ahead and get to that. Uh, the first thing that pops out of this box is the money. And they actually have it taped. They have this paper money taped to the plastic. So just be careful. It does look like it's coming off pretty easily from the plastic, but like, am I gonna be, it goes all the way across. Like, am I gonna be able to pull this without ripping? Okay, so, so far so good. Ooh, okay. That, I was kind of afraid for that. There was just a little glue residue at the end, but uh, that's, that uh, wasn't as bad as I thought it was. So we, we, here we have $8. So that'll probably buy you one boba tea, maybe. Um, this is a, a stiffer cardboard and it's perforated. So you actually have to like fold it to, to break the or tear the ones apart, which I think is interesting. I haven't seen that. A lot of times I've seen like cheaper paper with dollar bills. And I know especially American Girl does that. Um, they come apart fairly easily. Um, I, d I think I do like the, the tougher cardboard, like, not cardboard, um, paperboard. Paperboard is the better word for that. It's paperboard. And it is waxy, so, um, I think that's kind of an interesting, just an interesting change. So, I've got my, oh, my $8. Uh, okay. So, yeah, money, that's not the important part. Well, I guess it is if you're going to buy Boba Tea. And speaking of money, there is a cash register. It does have a drawer that it isn't, it's just an opening mechanism. It, there's nothing super exciting about it, but it does open instead of being one chunk of plastic. And the dollar bills fit nicely in the tray. And you can go there. Um, on here, it looks like we have a matcha milk tea for $5 and a strawberry slushy for $4 which is $9 and they only gave me $8. So I'm going to have to find another dollar to, um, <laughs> to pay for my order apparently. So we've got, oh, this is going to be really helpful. So it has all the different, uh, different types of, uh, boba and slushy they offer. And then they also have the tapioca, mango, strawberry, and passion fruit. And so I guess that's what these are. That, that seems to match up. 
Um, so the passion fruit, even though it's rainbow on the cash register, it looks like they're these pieces here. Uh, these are in a really nice set. Um, they're, it is taped. So um, I'm going to try my best not to open this and have it fly everywhere. That's my greatest concern with this. It is taped rather nicely. But I don't want these to go flying everywhere. These are the super tiny pieces like... You know, whoopsie, yep, it's going to go flying everywhere. Uh, this is what I, this is the kind of stuff that I think just, yes, it's cheap plastic, but the fact that they're all individual, they are not clumped, each piece is separate from the other is just, you know, I think this, this right here makes that a great deal. You can pick and choose, your dolls can decide exactly what they want in their, their boba. I just, I think that's a great idea on the part of my life as, so. Speaking of uh, the actual boba, so this is where, parents, I gotta warn you, these are slime. I don't fully know what they were thinking, but, okay, so there's a plastic, let me see if I can get this off. There is a plastic, and you know, I'm doing this on carpet, shame on me. Um, parents, be warned, if you don't have not already figured this out. Um, and it's not just parents, anyone who is playing with slime, and of course it's the parents, but if you have anyone who's playing with slime at your house, please, 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 please be super careful. Um, I think what I will probably do um, <laughs> is I will, man, I am not comfortable doing this on top of carpet. Let me get that. Let me get this. This, this is slime. This is I can't, like, it's one of these things that I think, yep, yeah, there it is. It's slime. Um, it's one of these things, uh, I said this with the breakfast set. Um, I think it's really amazing that My Life As is making these very, very interactive. Um, so essentially the idea for this set is you can take some slime, you can mix in your boba pieces with it, and then you're going to put them in the, the drink glasses. And then you have your very own... And the drink glasses and then you've got your very own boba tea and it's not going to look like anyone else's because you made it and you can decide do you want matcha or do you want strawberry what i will probably do um since i am not a player of slime uh and i'm really uncomfortable having it near my carpet um which i would say you should too it's very hard once it dries onto carpet to get up uh is I will probably remove the slime and wash this out and then I don't I'm okay leaving the jars empty I don't need it to be super realistic play but that does just add it adds such a great element of play for um, to expand your creativity if you want to so you do have two things of slime a green matcha and a um, pink strawberry and now that I just removed the plastic let me smell it I don't think it smells like anything but let me see ah, I'm so afraid of getting it on my carpet Phew. nope no no nice smells there Whew. nope no nice smells um but I think again very creative idea Is that um again we have we have a loyalty card which is kind of nice again we've got this tape taped right to it oh my gosh that's so scary the bubble tea they're calling it bubble tea um with the punch card which is really nice and then of course you can't oh i guess this is how i get i get around my not having enough money i have a credit card now i have a credit card so these are again paperboard like the dollar bill um these do not fit in oh i thought there was a card reader is there not Maybe I'm thinking of, I'm thinking of maybe a YouTube video I saw that they, they actually built a card reader for their grocery store. I think that was always dolls. That's what I'm thinking of. But if you don't have $9 now, you guys, look, it even has like the little chip, like the little chip card. I mean, keeping up with the times, I'm telling you. Okay. Um, then the other pieces in here are what you need to um, finish off your... Uh, complete your boba tea. Uh, one here is a jug of passion fruit. Um, taking this out of the box, the sticker did rip a little bit. 
Um, so just be careful with that. It is passion fruit syrup. This doesn't open, but it is cute and realistic. We have two containers that you can then put your um, add-ins into, which is a nice addition. And then we have the drink carrier, bubble tea to go. And you have two glasses. Uh, what's really nice, because this is supposed to be an interactive kit, um, you've got straws that remove, you've got lids that come off, um, which is very nice. And then if you want to simulate having a whipped cream on top, you um, have that option, which is kind of nice. Uh, so that's very interactive. You can pick and choose what you want your bubble tea to look like, your boba tea. Um, you can throw in all the different pieces that you want. Um, very interactive, very creative set. Again, my life as is just really, um, I think going above and beyond in their creativity with these sets. And at my Walmart, I know a couple places are a little different. Um, all of this was, uh, I think it was $11. I mean, it was less than $15 for sure. And that's just, I mean, yes, it's low quality plastic. You know, there's some, there are tiny little issues that I had with it, but you get slime, two things of slime. You get interactive, you get creativity, and it just adds a lot to this. There's also a menu here. Um, so I am going to uh, pause the video, get my doll set up with this, and I'll be right back. Okay, so here's the set with Kavi. Um, Kavika, um, Kavi, yeah. So the girl of the year, 2023, I figured, you know, she is a hard, um, a hardworking student and she's got so many extracurricular activities between her dancing and musical theater that I figured she would probably also be really into boba tea. So we have, um, the scale as always, you know, being a true um, 18 inch scale line, um, My Life As does a great job with the scale. Uh, this is on track with a lot of other things. Yeah, she's not wearing shoes, but I thought that was a cute outfit. I'll find the shoes. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna pan over to where the shoes are because they're a literal mess right now, I'm working on it. Um, but everything, is a great scale. I would say probably the only thing that's not a good scale, you know, the money to the credit card ratio, I, that's not really realistic. It doesn't bother me a whole lot. They're just the paper products, but the stuff that you would actually have your doll interacting with, I think that's a pretty decent size scale. So um, just keep in mind, you do come, this does come with two slime bottles. Um, I did put the, uh, the little add-ins in the little boxes that they're supposed to come in. I didn't sort them because they're only two boxes, so I just threw them in there. No particular order. Um, I also did find that these stickers, uh, while it's great that they have the little container to store them, just be careful with the sticker. They like to, it was starting to peel off a little bit. I mean, that's what you get when you have a toy that's <laughs> under you know, $15. So the stickers aren't perfect, but as a whole, I think this set is definitely worth the money. Um, I will be removing the slime at some point. Uh, I still don't know what I'll probably do. I could put, um, like a piece of like paper on the, on the inside. So it looks like it's full. Uh, I've also, played around with the idea of, um, have you ever seen those floral arrangements that are fake, that, but that have like fake water in them? Um, it's kind of expensive stuff, but I feel like at this point in my collection, I have enough like drink stuff that I could justify the cost. And it's just a powder and you add, I think you do add water to it and then it sets and then it becomes a a mess-free alternative to um, things like this. So you could actually have it, you know, like you could dye it with whatever color you want. So I could dye it with some of the neon green, actually gel food coloring I have, um, and then use that as an alternative. But that is kind of expensive. Uh, so 
for now, I mean, again, I also don't mind if it just looks empty. So just a thought there. Um, yeah, so as a whole, I think it's a great value if you're, you have, uh, well, you, or if you have people in your life that like to especially play like, you know, markets or grocery shopping or, you know, maybe the, the big coffee set, um, from American Girl is too expensive. This might be a really great, very cheap alternative. I know that, um, our generation also has quite a few sets that are, I haven't seen boba tea, but they have like, like there's a cookie cart and, um, they also had a, a juice set that, you know, it was a juice bar. Um, so this is just, again, another take on that, that same idea. Um, I think this is really well done and for the price, I think it's a definitely a really good value. So here is last look at Kavi in her, well, a springtime outfit. Um, gorgeous as ever so i just want to say thank you for watching this video and let me know if you um have ever bought any my life as and what you think of them as a brand i'd love to know in the comments thanks for watching and i'll see you next time